Do not forget, you can support the channel with a like and you can also subscribe to be aware of the latest published videos. Thank you. We hope that here you can find the latest news, ideas and discoveries from the scientific world. Asteroid 1950DA, a possible Earth impactor in 2880. March 16th, the year 2880. Looks like it could be a terrible day for Earth and anyone living here at that time. However, Thanks to recent updates to the system used to track dangerous asteroids, we and our distant descendants can breathe a sigh of relief. Asteroid 29075, 1950 DA, is a 1.3 kilometer wide space rock first seen on February 23, 1950. However, due to the timing of its orbit, astronomers lost track of it after that for just over 50 years. It was not observed again until December 31, 2000 about three months before the asteroid made a safe return to Earth at a distance of nearly 8 million kilometers. It was lucky that astronomers spied the asteroid. It gave them a chance to point the Goldstone and Arecibo radio telescopes at it as it flew past us. By bouncing radar beams off the surface of 1950 DA, they gave us a glimpse of its size and shape and gleaned more details about how it moved through space. Given the potential damage of an asteroid impact, any chance of a hit deserves attention. In a 2003 study of the possible impact of 1950 DA in 2880, researchers examined what would happen if the asteroid crashed into the Atlantic Ocean, about 300 kilometers off the U.S. east coast. They found that it would produce a crater nearly 20 kilometers across the seafloor, with a 100-meter high tsunami crashing down the east coast within two hours of impact. In addition, Western Europe and West Africa would see waves of 20 meters arriving around 12 hours after the impact. The latest update on 1950 DA, issued on March 29, 2022, by scientists at NASA's Center for Near-Earth Object Studies NEOs, and ESA's NEO Coordination Office, significantly reduced the asteroid's threat. As of now, the impact risk has been reduced from 1 in 8,000 to 1 in 30,000. This is almost a 4x decrease from the threat level of 1950 DA. It also went from minus 1.4 to minus 2.0 on the Palermo scale. Any lower, and they would likely remove 1950 DA from their risk lists altogether.